this this obviously isn't a super high level strategy, but see here, I kind of get myself into a situation where I'm chasing this Kali kill. By the way, this isn't the greatest play for me either. But I'm chasing this kill on her and she gets away, right? So I'm diving into the back line to kill her. Terrible idea. And you're going to see, I'm going to get myself into a spot where I'm pretty much dead. At this point, I'm dead. Paula ults me. And now I'm basically thinking that I'm screwed. So you see here, he's going to he's gonna hit me. And I'm going to get to about one health. And instead of running towards my jungle, I run towards his buff. This is really the tip here. Is using the jungle buff to kind of dodge basic attacks. Because Apollo was out of abilities there. He used all three of his abilities in his kit. So he had no way to kill me except auto attacking. So instead of running towards my jungle, I ran to the buff and kited the buff around to take the auto attacks away. That really is just it. Just a uh, really simple tip. It's it's going to save you if you know it though. And a lot of new players really don't know this. I'll see people, you know, barely any health. They'll just try to run straight line. They'll auto attack down. So if you're in the situation like this, you know, you're going to want to try to kite the buff around and dodge the auto attacks. And this, this will save your life at one point. You'll see this in a lot of pro players be doing this too. There's a there was a situation where a gold fury also was kited in a pro game and actually got a kill, and it really works with anything except maybe not the fire giant. Although I've seen it happen before. So you really that's that's it. You just want to use the uh, use objectives to dodge damage. Really simple tip. Hope it helps.